Hi guys, welcome to McAfee TV. Um, happy Boxing Day, which is obviously after Christmas. And um, yeah, I hope you all had a good uh, holiday or a good day. Myself, yeah, I got a couple of presents and a couple of things like that. And through Boxing Day, I got some, I went to get some Boxing Day sales. Uh, wasn't quite as successful, but there's one thing I've got to show you. Right. Um, I don't know if you have this <coughs> in your part of the world, but here in the UK, um, when you, June Christmas, you have what's called the Christmas jumper. Now, the Christmas jumper is a Christmas related jumper and it's quite tasteless. So today, as I was going through the sales, I saw one which was uh, very cheap and I thought, let's get that for next year because it's something that I'd never normally get, ever, you know, I'm not normally that type of personality, so I thought, yeah, next year I could make people laugh, so without further ado, here, here it is, look, it's like this, look. let me just show it to you, right, so that's, this is what I'm wearing right now, look at this Santa, with a rocket launcher, and then just get that, hold on, Slays are so last Christmas. Yes. Chain not included. Um, <laughs> so, yeah, that's something I never normally, never normally get. It's, and as you probably guess, I slot try to keep a low profile. And uh, by the way, this type of t shirt is a type of t shirt you would wear on the street. So, Come next Christmas, I'm going to try and make this happen. And if I'm still vlogging or whatever, yeah, you know, this time next year, you may um, see me not only wear this, but actually take it to the street. Who knows? Why don't you remind me, please? So, yeah, anyway, um, topic of the video, uh, it's a couple of, well, I can't remember how many months ago, but I did a video for a viewer which was demonstrating myself going into a shop and trying attempting to start a conversation and um, I've been doing it for quite some time anyway and uh, I've been doing it for years and I've been doing it recently too so another uh, one of my viewers or someone I spoke to online is going for that same thing they want to try it themselves and they want to know how to extend the conversation. So, in addition to me giving him some tips, my, I decided that I was going to film myself going into a, going into a shop and trying not only to just have a conversation, but actually extend it to a point where I'm, make, I don't know, making some jokes, asking their names. Um, these are things I've done in the past. So, in my area alone i know there's four shops where i know the shopkeeper by name where everyone speaking terms by name so it's quite it's quite it's quite good but what i did today was after i went shopping i took the opportunity to go to another part of town and uh, there was two shops and i thought what i'm gonna do i'm gonna go in there you know, say hello at the start and, you know, try and get a conversation going with them. Well, to cut a long story short, both of them were complete flops. So, one of them, um, which, which I do have a video for, is basically, as soon as I went in, the woman was on the phone. And not the, not that the last video where they were texting on the phone, she was literally on her landline phone just talking. So, that pretty much cut just pretty much just I, it didn't make me want to talk to her anyway you know I, obviously it's bad customer service but it's just a barrier um this and what i'm going to do i might as well just show you that video now but like i say it's a complete full up so i'll do that and then i'll come back to you How you doing, alright? Yeah. Okay. So, so. 
goodness. Let's not know. Typically, the shopkeeper was on her phone. But I don't care. If she's on her phone, I'm going to try to start some conversation. If not, I'll just walk out. But I want my drink. Thank you. Bye-bye. Okay, so... So she was on her phone. <laughs> the land was on her phone. Yeah, she was on the land on her phone, so... We really couldn't break into the conversation at all. I know last time I thought, oh, with the last video I'd done, the woman was texting. Obviously, you could talk to someone when they're texting, you know, they're on their phone, you know, whatever. And we could go on about customer service or whatever, but it's an off license, really, so you can't really expect much anyway. I want to give one more go to another shop, which is about two minutes walk away from here and just see how that goes in a bit. Yeah, so that's the first video. Um, I did do, immediately after that, I went to another shop, which was about five minute walk away. And I, despite that experience, I decided I was just gonna try and forget that and just move on. Um, so I recorded it. Unfortunately, it didn't record. So I'll just give my um, explanation of what happened. So I walked in and immediately no one was on the shop floor. There was no one there. So I shouted, I said quite loudly, oh, there's nobody here. You know, I said it very loudly. And a guy comes out and I say, hi, how are you doing? He said, oh, hello, hello, hello. I put my hand out to shake his hand and he did shake my hand, but he seemed a bit, you know, distracted with the whole thing. So I said, oh, I'm just going to buy some stuff. I bought a chocolate bar and I said to him, are you busy today? He said, no, no, I'm not busy. I'm about to close. I think the conversation went, oh, you're, oh, you're closing now. Is it? Is it that like dead or something like that? And he was like, yeah, it is pretty much. And I said, what time do you start? And he said, eight o'clock. To be honest, with his whole demeanour, I didn't really feel, I wasn't getting energy from him. So I didn't, for myself, if I'm going to build a rapport with someone or get humour, I don't go in scripted or whatever. I just go in and try to get on the vibe. And um, maybe it says something about, you know, my areas or where I've gone to. But previously where I've gone to, people have been, you know, friendly. They've been smiling and joking. This guy just wasn't smiling. So I just thought, yeah, 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 I've done my bit. You know, song, film, sadly, I f it didn't film. And... Um, so yeah, two today have flopped. This, this normally, obviously to show this person who I've been speaking to online, it would be good for me to just not, not even acknowledge this happened and just save it for another time when I am successful. But the reason why I'm uploading this or I'm even giving you the story is to tell you that, yeah, it doesn't happen 100% of the time. You know, if something does go wrong, it's no reflection on yourself. It's not a sign that you should give up overall, you know. Um, if it might be a case where the majority of people don't give that um, opportunity to yourself. But even if it's that, that minority of people who are happy, who are engaging, who are open-minded, that's all you need. So it was... 
particularly with like I'm, it's the same I didn't have two of them because I wanted to it's embarrassing for my, it's slightly embarrassing for myself that I'm trying to set an example but it's good that you know I, this is to show you that I don't mind I not only do I mess up myself not only am I okay messing up myself, but I'm okay showing you guys me messing up because it's no reflection of myself. It would be completely, even if I was to say, oh, it doesn't matter, it would be completely um, hypocritical for me to then not show you an event of mine actually happening. Because every time, every approach I've done, from today's one or the last one, was me just saying that I'm just going to go in there, I don't know the people, I'm just going to walk in and whatever happens, happens. So, um, that's what happens. Um, I'm going to... There's nothing really to write, really, isn't it? So, I was going to like <laughs> write out a transcript of what was said, but pretty much the only thing the conversation I had was in the second video and I've forgotten that so yeah that's it I'm sorry I wasn't um as expected to the viewer in question but you know this is what it is you know it's not right 100% of the time you know even the best you know even the best sports teams or best sports people in the world lose at some point yeah, so there's, we just got to acknowledge that, and um, yeah, maybe I'll, there'll be another point where I actually will film um, one where I'm successful. But you know, you get to see all of me inside and out. Okay, so yes, that's a video, um, very quick one. But uh, yeah, hope you enjoy it. And if I don't speak to you, a happy new year. And remember, guys, big chain. We love it. Santa Eva Rocket Pack. Take care.